Hi, this is Irish Caravans Devon Branch and it is the 1st of April 2022 and we're going to do a quick walk around video showing some of the vans which we currently have in stock. We normally do van specific ones but we've been very busy buying and taking part exchanges and in a time for the motime industry when everybody is very very low on stock we've got a decent selection of some things and some of the things we're going to have a look at are some of our smaller vans. As you can see from the roofs there we've got although they're selling very very quickly on a daily basis a, a particularly good selection of camper vans at the moment so we'll have a quick whistle stop brief tour of some of the camper vans that we've got so this one is a very rare one for us to get it's a 2017 Westphalia Marco Polo or a Mercedes Marco Polo these are Mercedes is equivalent of a VW California and they're sold new through the Mercedes uh, van network so you'll get in a van I'm not an expert on these but ostensibly it's based on a Viano so it's a much higher spec than your average camper van that's based on commercial vehicles and uh, very automotively finished you've got an electric raising roof we've got electric soft closed doors we've got a tailgate which will come up which is electric there we go with access to the rear storage which is very smart all in black i'd like to say it's called obsidian black but i'm not an absolute mercedes expert so don't hold me on that it's got the side awning we'll have a quick quick little look inside of it this one's automatic as i think they all are and it's priced at 51.95 these are obviously way up in the 70s plus if you could even get one new you get a fantastic level of executive specification everything's controlled by this little controller down there which is very very smart Got the electric sliding door electric sliding bed and all very very um camper vanny so very different make an ideal day-to-day -day car you've got diesel power blown air heating really cool thing so that is the mercedes marco polo next to it rather tightly squeezed in is our new demo wild x proteus these have been fantastic sellers these are ford based from new conversions from wild x based on the transit custom this particular one's automatic it's got leather seats again wider bed at the back which is on rail so it can move backward and forward for more storage diesel heating three seat belts in the back two up front all your normal camper gear on the side with a pop top with a roof bed in it as well so that's the wild x proteus Next one along, coming into some of the cheaper ones, or cheaper ones, less expensive ones. Very rare, 2009 Sleeper Trooper Low Lines. It's got the uh, canvas side Remo roof on it. This particular one's automatic, priced at 34.95. Auto Sleeper, one of Britain's oldest converters from new. This is one of the later Troopers. They stopped doing them not that long after this. Surprisingly modern grey cabinet work with surprisingly not that modern upholstery choice, but you can have it redone. And the VW automatic gearbox with air conditioning. It's a really, really good cab spec. That's why she's 34.995, resplendent in silver. Next one along, it's a funny little wheel home for Ken's, one berth, very unusual. Uh, four seat belts, basically the size of a very small hatchback car based on the Fiat badged version of a Citroen Nemo. So it'll drive like a car and at 1.3 turbo diesel, you should be getting ridiculous fuel economy. In the back, you can configure this seat in here to be uh, seat belted travel seats, or it makes a single bed with a little side kitchen pod unit, mains hookup, tap, all your normal camping gear into something that's probably no bigger than a Vauxhall Corsa with, a, uh, with an electric raising roof, which is incredible. That's really cool. Now, this one here, we've just bought this, and this is one of the nicest vans we've bought of any description in a long time this is absolutely spectacular i really really love this so she's a uh, hillside birchover classic we're hillside main dealers and i think hillside build some of if not the best from new uh, conversions all from new these days highline spec this one is a 140 dsg automatic super desirable long wheelbase very rare i don't see many long wheelbases so plenty of room inside it's got the factory fitted awning factory sport line with the uh, front sort of style pack spoilers smart alloys and slightly lowered sportier suspension one owner from new 13,000 miles this is exceptional this van gentleman from kent bought it straight from hillside sold it to us and it's done 13,000 miles from new it is beyond immaculate it's a real credit to him 
priced at 41,995. It's fantastic. So high line, top of the range VW base. You've got the optional black side bars. Oh, and it's locked, which is a cry in shame because it's immaculate in there. I don't know why it's locked, but you've got a, a microwave in there as well and a RIB rib bed from Germany. You've got an SCA roof on it. It is a fantastic thing. Um, we'll get a proper video done on this, but you've got tow bar on the back as well. That's an absolutely belting buy for someone, that one. Jumping into one that's a little bit less expensive. 29.95 gets you this late 2011 Camper King. We are also Camper King dealers. This is a Charisma, which is ostensibly based on a Monte Carlo. It's got roof bars, which are handy for your surf bats. Factory solar panel, wind out canopy, nice alloys. Done a little bit of miles, not a lot. VWs get used as a car in Furness, so it's done 76,000 miles. It's a uh, five speed 102 brake. Five seat belts, four berth, price at 29.95 in silver. So it's a recognised uh, converter. Camper King are Britain's biggest VW converter. They do over a thousand a year. Inside, you've got your normal layout, bonus of a grill, 12 volt fridge freezer, rock and roll bed, and then a double passenger seat which spins around. Yeah. Nice little thing for 29.95. All of our stock comes with a new MOT, engine service, cam belt change if needed, and our own 12 month in house warranty that's the best in the industry. Next one along is a 57 plate Bilbo Selects. Now, Bilbo, a bit like Hillside, they convert from new, they're VW official recognised converter like Hillside. I think they're about the only two in the country that are. Long wheelbase in, I uh, can't remember what colour they called this, but it's like a light greeny gold, really, really nice. Price at 32.95, it's another automatic, which is so, so rare and desirable. It's got the 2.5 turbo diesel, 130 horsepower engine. It's only done 50. My favorite thing with Bilbo's is I love this side roof. Now it doesn't really make a bed up there, but it's got big windows in it, which is, I think, that's a fantastic thing if you don't need the roof bed. That's locked as well, it's driving me mad but it's, it's got a good quality bed in there, grill, fridge. I'll have to go and get the keys and unlock these. All of our stocks should be unlocked. Maybe they're locking themselves. Next one along, this short wheelbase Transit Custom is a 2020 van with a tow bar. It's just a tin top, this one. It's been converted by Nigel at TC Conversions, who's local to us. We do a lot of work together. He's a lovely guy. Uh, he does conversions however anybody wants them to be. And this is, I say, 2020. It's done 30,000 miles, so it was used as a, uh, a work van for a year, and then the gentleman had it converted for himself, so we know it's a good one. And the good thing is with it, so it's virtually new, quite dirty, it's just come in. Automatic, never ever see these in automatic. So you've got six-speed automatic, you've got your big screen, um, I don't know if that's sat nav, but it's certainly got your camera and things like that on it. Cruise control, um, all mod cons in there. That doesn't swivel, you could put it on a swivel base. You could It's almost like a day van, this, in fairness to it, but if you wanted to spend a little bit more on it, you could put a roof on it for five or 6,000, swivel base for about 400 pounds, and then you've got a fully functioning camper. Front and rear parking sensors, alloy wheels. You'd struggle to buy a commercial vehicle automatic uh, for much less than this. It's 31,000 miles, heated front screen, priced at 32,995, and it's fully converted, it's a proper thing. And it's unlocked, which is a bonus. All your normal gears, you've got a two burner gas hob, 12 volt Vitrofigo fridge, forward facing crash tested seat belted uh, seat at the back there, which is wider. All this floor space. So with the Transit Custom, they're just a little bit wider than the v so you get a bit more floor space. Ideal for overnighters as a day van. I don't think he ever camped in this. He just used it for sort of day trips and things like that. So you've got main hook up, leisure battery, all the gear. So if you want to complete it, put a roof on it, swivel base, and then you're still getting change from 40,000 for a professionally converted 2020 Transit Custom. We'll use it as it is for sort of days out and, and overnighters. It's quite stealthy as it is, which is a good thing. So that's a TC conversion. Ford Transit Custom Automatic, it's only 32,995, it's a good buy for someone that it suits. Next one along, lots of campers as we say, this is a brand new hillside, this is our display model. As we stand, uh, we've got one automatic one of these, which is a bit more expensive, an Indian grey in build, which is available. 
or oh no this one's sold yeah I forgot about that this one's sold um, but you can look at it and you can um, you can pick off the ones that are coming in so there's uh, two automatic ones of these hillside birchover classics one's built one's in build which are available one of them has to replace this as our display model but at this stage on the 1st of April the other one's available so you can either have a silver or a grey automatic one of these hillside birchover classics this will be what that grey one, second hand one is like inside. So you've got the RIB bed, so it's not a slide out one. You pull a lever, that flips over. Pull another lever, the backrest comes down. Diesel power, blown air heating. This unit opens up and behind there is storage and your fridge and the grill as well. Two burner hob, high line based, single swivel passenger seat. A brand new unregistered this manual was £55,000 the autos are just over 60 we've got a 150 brake uh, Indian grey auto in build uh, which is available or we've got a built and yet to be delivered silver 204 horsepower for those who want the extra bit of power um, which will probably be about 63,000 ish and that's awaiting delivery to us at the moment so one of those is available one's one sold the other one needs to replace this lovely red one as our demo one next one along Another rare thing, another used automatic camper. You never see this many normally. We normally don't have any automatics. This is a late 2008 registered Adria from new converted Adria three-way space. Adria, a Slovenian giant. They've always marketed this model in Europe. Every so often they offered some right-hand drive for the UK. So you've got five seat belts, four berths, Renault traffic, short wheelbase, 2.5 turbo diesel with a six-speed semi-automatic box. 25995, uh, 63,000 miles in black, bit different these. Not a bad buy for someone in furnace. You've got the pop top on the roof, opens up on the European side, and inside you've got a triple seat belted seat on rails like the Wild X Proteus that moves backward and forward and folds into a large double bed, and then a large roof bed up there. Twin swivel cab seats, but the handbrake gets in the way of the driver's seat, so it's easier to swivel the passenger seat. And then your normal kitchen down the side with your gas hob, gas locker there, and your 12 volt Waco fridge freezer. So that's the automatic Adria three way space. Next one along is Tigger, another used hillside Birchover classic. This one was special ordered from new, it's got its own Instagram page. It's a really cool thing. So you've got factory load suspension. These sort of uh, orange alloys, obviously the signal orange paint. It's not called signal orange, that was a Ford cover colour, but uh, the orange paint styled bars and things on the front of it. Uh, to order a new one of these today to this spec, uh, probably £72,000. This one's 36995 Again, it's Highline chassis. It's the 2 litre, 180 horsepower range top in six, uh, six speed manual gearbox, only under 46,000 miles, priced at 36,995. This one's a really fun van, it drives fantastically well. We went all the way to Nottingham to buy this one, we love it that much. So, again, you've got the SCA pop top on it, chrome sidebars. Looking inside, short wheelbase, this one you've got leather, black leather, real leather, RIB bed with orange stitching. And that slide out unit with your grill and fridge behind it you've got a an aftermarket big screen unit which may or may not have nav i'm not sure on that aircon cruise control uh, all your normal high line bits and bobs very very smart thing diesel heating there is another video just of that van on our youtube channel if you like next one along Oh, another auto sleeper trooper. This is the last of the solid side roofed auto sleeper troopers, which are how uh, auto sleeper used to build them. This one's been uh, updated a bit, which is kind of cool. So you've got some custom headlights, it's been lowered a little bit, chrome sidebars and steps, alloy wheels. You'd think the previous owner was a youngster, but they weren't in furnace to it. They just uh, liked uh, modernizing their van a little bit, which is kind of cool. You've got the wind out awning, it's got some custom graphics on it, which again make it just look a little bit fresher. Really nice quality interior, these auto sleepers converted from new, obviously, by auto sleeper in the Cotswolds. We've got some LED disco lights, we've got an expensive solar panel on the roof, been really well cared for. This van, and you've got this solid side roof, so you can add bars to make it into a roof bed, but it's more of a two berth. This, but you've got four seat belts, and um, very, very smart air conditioning, manual gearbox, but it's the bigger engine, the 130 horsepower with a six speed. Um, reversing sensors, really, really good spec in furnace. That, that solar panel on the roof was £700 apparently. And we've got a three way fridge freezer on these, hob, grill, sink, drainer, 
a porta potty cupboard. I don't think there's a porta potty in it, but there's a cupboard for one. Very, very smart thing again, and that's done. It's got the Westphalia tow bar on the back for uh, for a bike rack if you wanted to add a bike rack. And this one's done 67,000 miles. The V dubs do do a little bit more than some. Next one along, looking very smart in black, is this Eco Wagon. Eco Wagon are a converter from Cornwall. Uh, very well thought of, very modern, well built conversions. This one's converted about 18 months ago. Uh, it's done 60,000 miles ish. It's a 102 or 110 brake 2 litre T5.1. What you get with Eco Wagon is you get this very light, modern, spacious interior. So we've got a roof bed up there. We've got a double sliding rock and roll bed at the back there with two seat belts, 12 volt fridge freezer, hob, all the other normal stuff. No heating in this one, but if you're on a campsite, you can carry a plug in one or you can have a diesel system fitted. Single passenger seat. If you were to if you think these are aftermarket conversions, they all start life with a double passenger seat normally. Uh, this was actually converted combi, I believe. Um, but if you were to convert that from a double to a single passenger seat, it costs about £900. So we've got air conditioning. Five speed gearbox, all in really, really good, really fresh condition. This was another buy in, uh, we really like that. It's a smart thing, and it's 37.95 again with full MOT engine service and such like. Next one behind it is a 64 plate T5.1 big wave, another Cornish converter, four berth, four seat belt, only done 34,000 miles from new price at 34.95. Stacks up price wise with the other ones. Got a colour to it, anything with a colour to it's good news. Got some uh, chrome bits on it as well, just to dress it up a little bit. Inside, it's pretty generic VW conversion, that's what Big Wave do, and they do it very well. Nice and modern, good condition. All your normal stuff, so gas hob, 12 volt fridge freezer, double rock and roll bed. Uh, double swivel passenger seat on this one as well and cab spec wise she's a five speed 102 horsepowers uh, with air conditioning any VW you can remap uh, oh, I think it's got cruise control as well yeah it does have cruise control but any VW can remap so if you want 180 horsepower you can just plug in a computer and it will remap for a couple hundred quid but they don't need it that's fine five speed gearbox that's all the horsepower you need got a tow bar on the back for a bike rack and it's got an awning rail up there for an awning finally for this whistle stop tour of all of our campers we've got this one a late 2018 it's another Volkswagen eco wagon it's another uh, eco wagon conversion it's another automatic so this one's in Indian grey so our hillside brand new it's in uh, in build uh, is this colour um, 140, 150, 140, 150 auto. It's done 75,000 miles. It's priced at 42,995. Converted just over a year ago, so it's very, very fresh. Uh, short wheelbase. Got a lot going for it. This one. It's not been messed around with standard alloys. Decent roof. Eco wagon. They're not cheap converters. These are quality. People do know and look for these. Same modern interior as the black Eco Wagon, um, but with the benefit of the bigger engine, the auto box. It's a Highline chassis, so you've got your auto headlights, cruise control, air conditioning, uh, and your other sort of bells and whistles. And it's got a very expensive German RIB bed instead of the rock and roll one, as well as your roof bed. Normal stuff over there, 12 volt fridge freezer. Hob, mains hook up, leisure battery. Very, very good. All in perfect condition as well. It's an absolute credit to the owner. It's not seen a lot of life. All nicely done. So these, as we stand, are our camper selection. We've got plenty of bigger van conversions. We got some coach builts as well. So in a time when the leisure industry is lacking in stock, it changes all the time, uh, but we've got a decent selection. So come and visit us at Highbridge Motorhomes Devon branch. We are just off the A38 South Devon Expressway. There it is, uh, just south of Exeter, just before you get to Newton Abbott. Um, yeah, come and see us. Highbridge Caravans Devon. Thank you very much. Bye-bye.